Well, Senator Rourke is, <clears throat> this is just my opinion, but he's the most powerful man in Sin City. Um, I get the feeling that all of the enterprises in Sin City he gets a piece of because he's the major politician um, and he uh, is sort of a um, power controlling godlike figure. Um, fearless because he knows what strings pull what puppets. Uh, in this environment particularly, but outside so that it makes this environment his. Uh, Senator Roark uh, has a lot of fun with Johnny. Uh, he perceives him as just this young hotshot who uh, thinks he knows a lot more than he does. So he just sort of baits him and toys with him. first time I did uh, uh, worked on the green screen, it was a little odd to me, a little strange, you know, I kind of got, this time around I knew what it was going to be and it was much, uh, I, felt, I felt much freer and much uh, um, more able to um, do what I do in conjunction with those two gentlemen. I'll never forget in the opening of Sin City when the beautiful woman looked one way and turned around and it was all black and white and suddenly her lips were red. And it was like, whoa, you know, this is um, very special and very hot and uh, uh, it's going to take me somewhere that I haven't been.